I went to Pavilion, I feel poor as f there. Why? Don't let these luxury retail sales professionals punk you. They're not better than you. I used to go into Tom Ford and I would ask for free samples. After a long struggle, I have finally made a decision. Okay, yeah, okay. You know what? I was actually gonna go to Optimus Coffee, but I'm a huge dick. I, I, I have a huge dick sucking lips for Arabica Coffee. Oh my god, yes. I did not know Arabica has came out with this much. They even have their own scale now. Travel grinder? Wow. They really did blow up, huh? Can I get a, uh, a cold brew or a cold drip? Chemex, please. Chemex, please, yes. Ice, yeah? Ice, please. When I first had Arabica coffee was back in 2007 in Kyoto, before it was it got blown up. How much is 19 RM in US dollars? Dude, that guy's an NRG fan, man. He watches ASU. His name is Mark. I told him to say what's up in chat later. He asked if I was from NRG, and I said yes. We're leaving Malaysia now and we're entering Times Square, New York City. Here we go, poggers. Look, Times Square. We're in New York City. Pog. Dude, how are people wearing like... I can't. I went to Pavilion, I feel poor as f there, why? The key to go to places like this is you just go in and act super obnoxious. Guys, I used to work in luxury retail. I'm about to tell you guys the biggest secret. You go in and you act obnoxious because then they're gonna get thrown off. Don't let these luxury retail sales professionals punk you. They're not better than you. You go in and you show them your dick. Swinging left and right. Who the f cares if it's Dior? Who the f Care if it's LV. They're just people that work there. Sales. You don't need to feel poor. F that. They expect you to go in and feel intimidated and get like get shy because everything in there is obviously expensive. But you go in and you just be like, Yo, what's up, man? And they're gonna be like, What the? F Same with Supreme. Same with all the high end, high end store, high end streetwear, everything. You guys go in, show them your. F Dick. It's not cringe and inspirational. It's actually facts. Seriously, dude. Don't go into a luxury retail store and feel like you should be extra careful. Nah, never. Show us. I'll show you guys. Watch. This is how you go in and assert dominance. Not even a security guy here. Oh, the entrance is on the other side. Dang it. My plan has backfired. Oh. Why is there a line for Dior, man? It's not like they're gonna buy stuff. I mean, kind of like me, dude. I was just gonna go in and do nothing, but Valentino? I'll, I'll check out Valentino. Hello, how are you? Oh, pretty shoes. Yeah. All right, this is awkward now. I'm gonna get the fuck out of here. You go in and you show them your dick. They don't wanna service me. They see my hair, they think <laughs> I have no money. <laughs> Oh, hair? Oh, thank you. It's real. Yeah. It's real hair. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I just wake up. I go to sleep and I wake up. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, thank you. All right, we should, we should go. We should go. We should go. I feel like the husband was about to kill me. That's why I, I was like, maybe I shouldn't just line up behind him because I was feeling the dagger eyes. Like, big trouble, right? Big trouble. You know what I used to do? I used to go into Tom Ford and I would ask for free samples because I can never, I can never afford my favorite cologne. I don't have enough money for it. Maybe today we go and I can finally get more free samples. And their sample I, I can use for two months. Yeah. All right, this is how, this is how true alpha is. Hi, how are you? Oh, yeah, good. Good, good. So yeah. back in the days, I used to be very poor uh, yeah. and I cannot buy my favorite cologne. Oh, yeah. So I would go into a Tom Ford store uh, yeah. and then the lady would give me free samples. Oh, free and then samples. I would get the free samples and I would use it when I go out, you know, uh, to pretend saw. that I can afford Tom Ford. Uh, yeah. But today, I think I can finally, <laughs> I think I have enough courage uh, yes. to get more free samples. Oh, okay. let, let me ask for my colleague first. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Uh, but I am actually very interested in uh, purchasing my first Tom Ford. Uh, yes. Yeah. So I do know you guys have two sides, right? Yeah, we have a 10 mil. The 10 mil is select flavor. Like the Travis size optimizer. Yeah. But it's kind of like this, like transparent optimizer. Mm. 
<laughs> oh, there's no smell. Sorry. Oh, no, no, oh sorry. This is a travel size 10 ml. Oh, that's travel size. Uh, yes. This is not travel size. I thought travel size is 100 milliliter. Oh no no no. Because in Malaysia we just carry 15 ml. This is my favorite. What does that say about me? Uh, just because it's like a bit like flora, yeah, flora flavor scent. Yeah. A bit slightly feminine. A little feminine, yeah, right? Little I like that. Feminine. Yeah. I like that. I like you know, I used to thought this was pronounced Jasmine Rogue, but it's Jasmine Rouge. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I play too much video game. One of my favorite Apex streamer, his name is. Uh, Rogue, yeah, he plays. Yeah, he plays Bloodhound. Oh, thanks. This one is, yeah. Hmm. You go in and you show him your dick. Wow, they're both really good. Yes, right. You brought me some really good contestants. <laughs> You're good. You're good. You know, my first Tom Ford product was one of you guys' sunglasses, and then it was as our discontinued. I think I got it for about two, three hundred dollars. Oh. And then I was in Taiwan one day. Oh, Taiwan. And I was and riding I was... my U bike. U bike. Yeah, I know, I know. I was riding, 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 and I left my sunglasses in the in the in the in the in, 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 in the bike, and I left. Huh? It's gone forever. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> so sorry. That. I'm so sad. Oh, I don't like this one. Now, if I do tax-free, uh, there's no tax anymore uh, in Malaysia. So you Ooh, just pay, uh, yes, the yeah. price. even better. Yeah. Exactly. But how much US dollar does this? I, I forgot how expensive uh, it was. I never, you know, I never bought cologne for myself before. Yeah. This will be my first time ever. And I told her, uh -huh. right? So I used to be so poor. Okay. And I cannot afford Tom Ford. So I would go to Tom's Ford store and I would get free samples mm -hmm. and I would use that for a month and I'll get another free sample Today I finally have the courage to come and get more free samples <laughs> You know, but I want to get different free samples. I'm just kidding. <laughs> All right What do you think which one oh, this is yeah. the one I always like and then this is the one that she just introduced me to hello I'm a huge fan of Tom Ford. So I used to... I, <laughs> I, I'm gonna tell her the same story again. Please do. So... Oh, she's gonna help. She's gonna help other people. This is, this is literally the heart, my hardest decision now. Does Tom Ford himself use Cafe Rose? Yes, but his personal favorite is... Dude, that was my first... Oh my god! Yes, I remember. I was like, what kind of name was that? I was like, yes, the Udud. Dude, I used to call the Udud. I used to call that. Dude, oh my god. This is actually his favorite? This was my first favorite. That is so funny. This used to be my favorite. I remember. I was just like, Udud. Have you guys met Tom Ford himself yet? Damn it. Okay. You know what? I think today I have made my decision. After a long struggle, I have finally made a decision. After all these years, of hard working, being the top sales of Tiffany and Company West Coast for three years straight. Finally, as a man. Yes. I don't think I can buy it yet. <laughs> but what? now I build up the courage to finally. I think I'm gonna go with Cafe Rose. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm gonna. I think I'm gonna do it. <laughs> yes. It's a huge step towards my manlyhood, right? You know, I never, I, I never bought cologne like like cologne for myself. This is to me is like my big boy move. I feel like I'm a, I'm a, I'm a man now, right? I feel glad for you. You feel glad for me. I feel glad for you too. You know, it's it's, it's, it's busy, very busy. Yeah. yeah. The receipts in the back, okay? Wow. You go. Please enjoy your fragrance. Thank you so much. Thank yeah, so appreciate much. it. Bye, everyone. Bye. Cheers. Bye. Okay, all, all jokes aside, I legitimately, I used to not be, chat, listen, I was not, I, I really couldn't afford a Tom Ford perfume. I was never able to afford Tom Ford. The sample shit was true. It's a real yeah. story. I would get free samples from Tom Ford because I couldn't afford Tom, Tom Ford cologne.